What's up, CK? Um, yeah, obviously, I thought full credit will go to the players really to respond after obviously last Saturday's result um, to come back with a performance like that. Um, you know, full credit to them. They've worked their socks off. Uh, they responded in the right manner um, uh, in training, and I'm glad they got rid of their rules today. Um, Ollie Pierce played well against his old club. Do you think that was playing on his mind at all? Or? Um, yeah, it's sort of always sort of been in my mind to start Ollie in this game. Um, you know, that's where he started, and he's had a long time there. Um, he's been chopping at the bit to, to play, and um, like any player, when they get their opportunity, they go and take it. And you know, he's done that, done that really well today. And I thought it showed, especially for his second goal, just what the type of quality Ollie possesses. Um, I think getting him confident is a uh, definite player that can score a lot of goals at this level. And um, you made three changes today. Um, obviously, Darren Bud was forced, but the other two um, have come in. And do you think you found more of your starting eleven now after last week's? Um, yeah, well, obviously Joel's injured as well, so he'll yeah, hopefully yeah. be back available for next week. Um, yeah, and I'd say just freshen up up front. Um, you know, it's no coincidence in my opinion that the two games we've got three points is the two games that we scored the first goal so um, you know we can't be reliant on that we've got to learn we've got to learn from that uh, moving forward but um, you know it is a massive part you know we could have easily took our chances and gone one off at Folkestone and the same at Hornchurch I think it's a completely different game if we do that um, and obviously today getting the second one was was um, settled everybody down and I think you know fully deserved for the way we sort of worked second half. And uh, Margot next week, do you think you'll go over a similar kind of lineup, or um, you feeling confident? Yeah, well, you know, if we're not confident after that performance, then we never are. But at the same time, um, you know, if anything comes from Hornchurch that you learn, you can never rest on your laurels. And at this level, you know, you've got to be at it in every game. Um, so we go there with, with, with full belief now, hopefully, and. I say we've got a good squad of players here. Hopefully, you know, Joel will be a little bit closer. Um, but you know, we've got one or two as well that are pushing for places on the way back, and um, see see how everybody is because they've put a lot of energy in on, on a Monday, really hot Monday. Uh, Marvin got through a lot of lot of running. Uh, same as Jesse and Ricky. I think uh, we've had a little bit unnoticed them too, but. Worked hard as well today, so we're passionate about see where we are and um, yeah, go to market with a lot of confidence, but knowing that it's a tough place to, to go, you know, it's, it's a tough start. We've had a tough start, right? The, the, the league's relentless, I think, this year, everyone's sort of similar. Um, so you've got to be at it every week, and um, you know, we know that we can't rest on our laurels today, we've got to be better next week, and because um, they could have got the first goal. Um, you know, it's a completely different game if they do that. So we'll analyse today, we'll learn from it and, and go to market with a lot of confidence. Love yourself. Well, congratulations for the win today. Thank you.